Yo, what's going on guys, it's Car Pig. Uh, this is the first time I've actually done a video outside like this before, but uh, we got a roller hockey video going. And today's video is gonna be Can It Michigan? We're gonna be taking a bunch of different pucks, including a ball, and we're gonna see if it can Michigan. From a regular green biscuit, to a green biscuit roller puck, to a green biscuit snipe, a fly puck, a regular puck, a pro shot puck, a standard orange hockey ball, and some random puck that I found laying out in the middle of the rink. All right, so Can It Michigan, let's get to it. So the first puck we got is the orange green biscuit roller. Now I know for a fact that this one can Michigan. It's actually very easy to pick up. Let's give it a try. We're gonna start with in motion to make it like a little more natural, a little more practical. It's gonna get increasingly difficult uh, with some of the pucks, so we might have to do stationary for some of them. But first one, orange green biscuit roller. Let's try. Uh. Oh, Sister shitty attempt. Uh. That was really silky, but I missed the net. So as you can see, the green biscuit roller is actually pretty easy to pick up. Uh, we got it on our third try. Realistically though, I did pick it up every single time. Now let's move on to the next one. All right, so the next puck we got is the dark green green biscuit snipe. Now these ones you can actually shoot, the light ones you cannot, otherwise you risk breaking them, especially against iron posts like these. I am speculating that this one's gonna be a little bit more difficult uh, given the fact that it has less of an edge to pick up and like actually grip on, but let's give it a try. I'm gonna keep my promise about going in motion because it'll make it more natural and more practical, but I think with this one, we're gonna start getting a little bit more difficulty, but let's give it a shot. We got some left there, but it wasn't quite on that. Second try. Absolutely no lift on that one. All right, third try. You might not be able to tell, but I got that one on edge just a little bit, but still, no height. And we actually knocked on the target. Also, I'm not sponsored, but shout out to Top Shelf Targets. These are the best in the game. All right, fourth attempt, I believe. I believe fourth attempt. All right, I suck. <laughs> we need to start counting real attempts because these are just my fault. We'll get it someday. So due to the fact that I suck, we're gonna try this stationary. All right, stationary attempt number one. All right, we got a lot of lift. I just did not aim it correctly. I hope you guys are starting to tell though, this one, a little bit more difficult. Now, I wouldn't consider myself a beginner. I also wouldn't consider myself an expert. But the fact that the orange one is that easy for me to pick up really says a lot about the Green Biscuit Roller Puck. So, here we go. Stationary attempt number two with the Green Biscuit Snipe. So we hit the crossbar, unfortunately. Stationary attempt with the Green Biscuit Snipe number three. Let's try and get this one in for once. All right, on attempt number three of stationary with the Green Biscuit Snipe, we got it in. Now let's move on to the next one. For our next puck, we have the Green Biscuit Original. Do not shoot these, I promise you, they will break. I've seen people break these on their first shot literally just after buying them. Do not shoot them, I promise. They will break against posts like these. Stick handle only, but for our purposes, will it Michigan? Let's find out. For this puck, we're gonna be doing stationary only. I need some kind of leverage here. All right, stationary attempt with the Green Biscuit Original, number one. All right, attempt number two. All right, attempt number three. I got the Green Biscuit original to Michigan on attempt number three. It's actually not as difficult as I thought it would be, but on to the next one. All right, so our next puck moving up in difficulty is the red pro shot puck. I'm like 99% sure that Pure Hockey still carries these. If not, I'm sure you can get them online somewhere. I don't have a ton of hope for this one because it's a little bit slippery, but let's see if we can do it. If this one's too easy, then we'll try in motion, but let's just see first. All right, that I had to retrieve because it went running on me. All right, attempt number two. All right, it really wasn't that difficult to get some lift on it. Let's try it a little bit in motion, but slowly. And we got it. We got it to Michigan. So it really wasn't too difficult. So now let's move on to the next puck. Okay, so the next puck is probably gonna be a little more difficult. You can probably tell by the sound. We have the fly puck. Now the fly puck, I'm also fairly certain that these are sold at Pure Hockey. If not, you can also find it online if you search up fly puck. And I'll leave a link to all these pucks in the description, so be sure to check that out. But um, this one's gonna be a little bit more slippery and it's probably gonna be a little more difficult because of that, but let's see if it can Michigan. Jeez, that sounds like a Lego. All my friends call this the Lego puck. Here, get a sound test of this. Yeah. This one's gonna be brutal. 
I think this one might be the most difficult. Let's see. Oh, and we got it to Michigan on our first try. I just could not quite finish it. All right, that was surprisingly not as difficult as I thought it would be. It's definitely very slippery, but I was able to get it on the second attempt. And for our next puck, we have a normal rubber puck, just ice hockey puck. You can get these literally anywhere. We'll see if it can Michigan out here on a roller hockey rink. Now, due to the fact that it has so much friction, I have no hopes for this. Uh, we might be able to do a little scoop version like this. Uh, you know, the pullback instead of the actual, like, going down for it. Let's try it out. Yeah, that has absolutely too much friction. All right, second attempt. No, it's not sliding at all. I can maybe get it though. Oh. All right, we're gonna have to try scooping. Whoa. Little awkward, but we got the actual ice hockey puck to Michigan out here on a roller hockey rink. I don't see why you'd be using an actual puck out here, but it can Michigan. All right, so our next puck, not actually a puck, a standard orange hockey ball. You can also get these about anywhere. Dick's Sword and Goods, pure hockey, literally wherever. I also don't see why you'd be Michiganing it, but let's try it. This thing is not gonna Michigan. There's no shot. All right, let's see if we can pick this up. All right, okay, okay. I can maybe get this around. All right, maybe in motion, it'll be easier. All right, we're getting there, we're getting there, let's see. We're getting it around, but not quite into the net. Whoa. Just off the crossbar. All right, come on. Whoa. There we go. So, a standard orange hockey ball. You can get these literally anywhere. It can Michigan. On to the next one. All right, our final puck, probably the most awkward, is a floor hockey puck. I found this literally when I pulled up. Uh, it's just a regular floor hockey puck and it's plastic. We're gonna see if it can Michigan. It's a little, it's a little difficult to pick up. It's incredibly slippery. Um, I'm gonna try a few more attempts in motion. If I can't get it in the next two, we'll try stationary. All right, and we hit the target. Don't ask me how, but we got the floor hockey puck to Michigan. Uh, actually, shout out to floor hockey. I'm wearing my shirt today, repping it. For those of you who don't know, I played floor hockey for like my entire childhood all the way through high school. So, so kind of a nice throwback to see those pucks, but uh, definitely would have been illegal in my league. So there you have it, Cannon, Michigan. We just took all these pucks and we Michiganed every single one. As stupid as it sounds, it just goes to show that just about anything can be Michigan. Uh, let me know what you want to see me try to Michigan next in the next video in the comments, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.